हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू स्कूल मैनेजमेंट सिस्टम इन लारा लास्ट फ्यू वीडियो आई विल शो यू हाउ टू क्रिएट माय अकाउंट दैट टीचर साइड स्टूडेंट साइड एंड पेरेंट्स साइड सो नाउ जस्ट लास्ट वन इज रिमेनिंग लाइक एडमिन साइड सपोज एडमिन कैन चेंज हिज नेम एंड आल्सो ही कैन चेंज हिज ईमेल एड्रेस सो वी कैन डू हियर एडमिन साइड वी कैन पुट हियर लाइक लास्ट वन माय अकाउंट बिफोर चेंज पासवर्ड सो एडमिन ओनली हैव टू इंफॉर्मेशन टू चेंज सपोज आई कैन एडिट सो जस्ट नेम and email after future we can add a like more so admin can do it so first of all we need to create here a my account mem so let's go to code inside resources inside views inside admin and and inside no not admin go to layout inside you can go added.blade.php so is it let's zoom out first go down and uh, change passwords okay here the change password there just copy otherwise you can go down and just copy and put here before change password change to your picture to add here is the account because we need to make active button so this is the like a segment equal to account okay i will refresh the page so you can see it here like a new menu like a just wait because is a refreshing Why taking time? I don't know. Let's make it fresh again. A few seconds. Let's create a new one. Sometimes server side is generate the issue because uh, like server uh, side this isn't slow. Okay, now you can find out here menu. Also, I think here you can find out. Let's close this one. We don't need now. So I will click on this my account. So here showing the not found because we have not created routes. So let's go that again. Just go to routes. Insert go to web. Insert just copy to route about the account. Here just put before the change password. Here you can change like a admin. Admin update my account. Admin. You can change here new routes like post method we did update my account. Admin. So let's go to user controller. user controller inside we have already created like a student teachers and parents let's copy and put here and just make it else if so means uh, this is the else is going for a student and one is the admin so just change the name admin so we need to create a admin inside like um, my account blended php we need to create a new file So just go to inserts, admins. Okay, here new files. Blade dot php. Okay, so files created successfully. Let's refresh the page and checks. So you can see files successfully created. But where is going to? Let's because I have not saved this one. This reason I let me save now. I refresh the page. so you can see it like blank okay so we need to create uh, these files inside code so just go to admin and then go to edits just copy and put it here and you can change let's refer the page so i can show you first after you can change the name so we can change here name my account so let's make a here my account save and refresh so you can see it like my account we don't need a password just change the passwords and here we already made a like validation emails and names okay i think now is good now i will save and i go to the name so you can see it password is removed once i will click on the update so we need to update both information to our database database columns so let's create the actions Inside we have created same route for the post method, and also I have already done here like a web dot php inside. You can see it like a post method. So just we need to create a new function. Update my account admin. Okay, I think we can create here. So it's possible. Let's create here function. Request order request. Just copy. And put it here. And we don't want to make a email address, mobile number. We don't need right now. 
screws remain and this the combination working very well now just we can need a like uh, two parts here so like this just copy and paste here and change the picture to admin okay name we can update and email also we can update. just you can change here email and emails okay and we just need to write a redirect function here comes it's fully updated so just copy paste did direct to back with success account successfully updated i think now it's clear let's try now so just click go, go back and refresh the page after click on the update function so just going to update okay working very well now so let's make like here admin one i click on the one so you can see working very well no issue and here you can see also change the name okay now it's good so we need to show here messages so we know okay this is the information updated so just go to like a picture site the student site i go to teacher site instead go to my account i just copy these message files and i close these files and i go to my account admin site admin my account and i put here in the files and this is the file i already declared here you can see it here message this is when i'm including inside we have write all the function about the messages success error payment errors okay let's try now i save these files and try i go back again i refresh the page i click on the updates so you can see account successfully updated okay let's go to teacher's account and i copy these emails and i put here this email so it is showing the app because this is the someone has accepted see this email has already has been taken why is this is the email not removed because of the we have used a old suppose here is a data there so showing this data otherwise showing the database data here and also we have a required fields so it's working very well validation also working so i think it's good for my account because we, we can add like a first name last name but my admin we don't need i think so so for future we need to use for this project so we can add okay so i think is my account tutorial means my account module is done like admin side teacher side parent side and student side so next module we can start like a teacher can assign subjects so with this teacher what what subject he can learn means he can study to student so we need to assign subject and after subject wise we can show okay for this teacher what is the student available is size so next video we can start these new modules and after we can do like a student phase and after we can do like examinations so we can start because now we are done like a normal module because it's not stuff modules now we are going to big module so we can understand how to work flow about school management system okay so do you want to like this video so please like and do you want to see like this video more so please subscribe our channel thank you for watching